Hello, welcome back to this video series on area of a triangle. In this video, we shall look at the base, height and area of a triangle. Previously on area of a triangle, we had a triangle ABC and a rectangle ABDE as shown. There was a question, is the area of triangle ABC half of the area of rectangle ABDE? You did a GeoGebra activity to explore the answer to the question. If you have not done it yet, please go to the previous video to do it. So, the answer to the question is, yes, the area of triangle ABC is half of the area of rectangle ABDE. Therefore, the area of triangle ABC is equal to half times 4 cm times 3 cm, which is equal to 6 square centimeters. Let's introduce some terms that we are going to use. The points A, B and C are called the vertices of triangle ABC. If we are talking about one of them, we say one vertex. If we are talking about many of them, we say many vertices. Rectangle ABDE is called the related rectangle of triangle ABC. Notice that triangle ABC and its related rectangle ABDE share a common side AB, which is this. The common side AB is called the base of triangle ABC. The other side of the related rectangle is EA, which is this. EA is called the height of triangle ABC. The height is perpendicular to the base. Perpendicular means at right angle. We can see the right angle here. We can move the height of the triangle like this. EA has the same length as CF. CF is also the height of triangle ABC. In this case, notice that the height CF starts from C, which is the vertex of the triangle that is away from the base of the triangle, and goes all the way down to the base. It forms a right angle with the base. We have found the area of triangle ABC just now. We can move the numbers around and still get the same answer. Now that we know that AB is the base of the triangle and CF is the height of the triangle, we can write the area of a triangle as being equal to half times base times height. Let's look at an example. The diagram shows a triangle PQR. Find the area of triangle PQR. Can you see the right angle in the triangle? Notice that the side PQ of the triangle is perpendicular to this line which starts from the other vertex R of the triangle. So, these are the base and height of the triangle. We can draw the related rectangle of triangle PQR like this. PQ is the base of the triangle. We need to find its length. So the length of PQ is 21 meters. Let's write it in. This side of the related rectangle is the height of triangle PQR and it is 8 meters long. 
So, the area of triangle PQR is equal to half times base times height, which is equal to half times 21 meters times 8 meters. We can move the numbers around so that they are easier to calculate. And we get 84 square meters. Let's look at another example. The diagram shows a triangle STU. Find the area of triangle STU. Once again, can you see the right angle in the triangle? Notice that the side ST of the triangle is perpendicular to this line which starts from the other vertex U of the triangle. So, these are the base and height of the triangle. It is a good habit to label on the diagram the base and height of the triangle. Let's draw the related rectangle of triangle STU to confirm. So indeed, ST is the base and UV is the height. The area of triangle STU is equal to half times base times height, which is equal to half times 14 meters times 12 meters. And that is equal to 84 square meters. Now, go and try some questions on your own. Goodbye.